So hey guys, welcome to another video, and today I want to talk about Legion, and how so far, bear in mind this is all subject to change, so far it gives me hope for WoW. And why is that? Well, mainly because they're willing to take risks again. Which is a very good thing with Blizzard Entertainment. Because most of the time, when they take risks, it pays off and it creates something awesome. I mean, World of Warcraft in itself was a huge risk when it was first released. I mean, before WoW, it was kind of heresy to not lose levels or XP or items upon death. You would die, you would lose three levels, and all your gear would drop on the ground. And if a game decided not to drop all your gear and strip off a couple of levels when you die, it was viewed as the baby's first game. All right? It was the casualest of games. It was for the little babies. And yet Blizzard decided to release an MMO without a death penalty. And in the beginning, World of Warcraft was hated by so many MMO players. Oh, it's the baby's first game. I remember talking to my friends and they used to play MUDs and MMOs before WoW. I never played an MMO before WoW. All right? So I came up to them and so I'm like, Haha, I'm playing WoW now, I'm playing an MMO too. The first thing that came out of their filthy mouth was, Oh man, you play World of Warcraft? Do you still have your diapers on? Oh my god, go and play a real MMO. Yep, and that was the response I got for playing World of Warcraft. And yet it turned out to be one of the best things about World of Warcraft. And so many MMOs followed that. You, you don't really see an MMO with a death penalty nowadays. And it was so sad for me to see Blizzard be so, well, safe for the past few expansions. I mean, they took risks, you know, the garrison, no flying and stuff like that. They took risks. But those weren't real risks. I mean, when they were going from vanilla to Burning Crusade, they were like, you know what, we really don't like this honor system, so we're going to change it whether you like it or not. If it works out, well, we'll have to see in the Burning Crusade. And they're doing the same thing right now. You know what, we don't like this honor system, so we're going to change it whether you like it or not. Does it work? We'll have to see in Legion. I mean, it takes some serious testicular fortitude to do something like this. And it takes some serious balls to not give us any weapon drops in the expansion and just give us this one artifact weapon that we're going to upgrade throughout the course of the expansion. Does it work? We don't know. We'll have to see in Legion. But it's good to see that they are coming up with stuff and they have new ideas. I like that. And I think there was a problem in the previous expansions, or at least a couple of them, where we were telling them what to do. And I am guilty of this myself. All right, we told them, oh, we don't like dailies, we like this, oh, you should do this, you should do this, you should give us that. And they tried to work with it. They removed dailies, and they added dailies, then they did this, they did that, they did that, they did this. And they didn't really do what they wanted to do. Because they were too focused on giving us what we want. And that's never a good thing. Because we want things that are familiar things that we've already experienced and we know they are good. The best example of this would be me. In Pandaria I was like, oh, you need to focus on hardcore raiders more. And that's exactly what they did in Warlords of Draenor and I'm sitting here like, uh, I don't like it. You know, it's kind of like my mother. Whenever she goes out to eat, she always orders the same things because she knows those things are good and she will never order anything out of the ordinary. And as a result of that, she has no idea that there is better food out there. I think it's way better if we just let them run wild. And sometimes they will fail. They will fall flat on their face. And they will break their knee. And they will be very sad. But other times they will create something awesome. And unique. And new. And after that, we can give them feedback. And they can improve it based upon our feedback. Instead of us telling them what to do. Because if we do that, we're just like my mother. We order the same shit every time. And yes, it's impossible to get everything right. Some things will just not work. It will be a failure. It will be terrible and we will hate it. But they can learn from that and try something new. And maybe we will like that. Maybe I'm just being stupid. You know, I just want this expansion to be good so bad that I'm willing to overlook some obvious bad things about it. But the fact that they're being ballsy again, they're trying out new things, I, I think that's a good sign. It feels more like old Blizzard rather than the new Activision Blizzard. I don't know. So thank you very much for watching once again, and I shall see you next time. Bye-bye.